Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for Easter. So, the 21st, April 21st, Easter. We're just going to see what comes up. This may or may not be for you. We're going to get one of these for an overall energy. Then we're going to use this deck right here. What do we have for Sunday the 21st? Keep in mind that the timing is fluid. The sun. This is happiness. Bliss. Contentment. Rebirth, perhaps. But this is happiness, right? It is. This is... enlightenment of some sort this could be seeing the light in a situation as well so we'll see what we get to go with that card vitality Looks like it's going to be a happy day. Mm. Somebody may be seeing the light. Right? Maybe they've seen the light. It's like this is coming out of the shell. This is taking a new approach. This is this is a new adventure. This is good news. So, yeah, we have somebody that may be you know, coming out of a period of isolation, they have seen the light, they've become enlightened. So yeah, that is enlightenment, it is. This is taking a new approach. Excitement, exciting new adventure, exciting new opportunity here. Thing keeps hitting something, making noise. Ooh, this is good. This is this is personal freedom. Breaking free from a toxic situation. Somebody has broken free. They have. This is personal freedom. Taking back control. Ooh. Ooh. Somebody huh, maybe rebuilding. Rebuilding a new foundation here. Rebuilding a new structure. Maybe it's a new structure within themselves. Could be in a family dynamic. I don't know. This is giving up though. Not putting in effort. Not working. <laughs> Something hasn't been working. The false foundation hasn't been working. Maybe it's time maybe it's time to rebuild. Rebuilding happiness. <clears throat> Somebody has a lot of strength, has gained a lot of strength, a lot of wisdom too. Celebration. It is a day of celebration, isn't it? It's a celebration here. This is celebrating. Celebrating an exciting new opportunity here. Celebrating the good news. There could be some good news coming in that is being celebrated. Ooh. Yikes. Hmm. Now this is a loss. <laughs> I can't I can't pretend that it's not. Okay, I'd like to, but I can't. This is a loss. Lost opportunity here.
there's been a lack of wish fulfillment. Somebody hasn't been putting in effort into following their dreams. They may have been holding on to that false sense of security. Maybe now they're letting it go. And they're rebuilding. We have somebody here that is rebuilding from the ground up. After a loss of wish fulfillment, after a loss of something. It's like they're not going to put in any more effort. I'm not going to put in any more effort in that false sense of security. I'm going to drop it and take back control of my life because I have a better opportunity for something that's better suited for me. I'm going to celebrate and be happy. Come out of my shell. Somebody has been enlightened that I own my own happiness. Somebody has given up on a, a situation that has bound them. It's, they're letting it go. Not going to put any more energy in it. Somebody is not putting any more energy into a false bond. You know? Somebody's giving up on that. They are. Congratulations. Congratulations. It's time to have fun. It's time to celebrate. I got a better suitor here. This is a new suitor. Somebody that's better suited for you is. Somebody's seeing that. You know, there's an opportunity for happiness here with somebody that's better suited for me. And it's like there's a newfound excitement for something. Huh. It's here. It's arrived. Something has arrived. The opportunity has arrived. Somebody's been waiting for this opportunity and the opportunity has arrived. It is. Hmm. It's like somebody has this new newfound optimism, right? It's like I'm going to be optimistic and take this new approach. Take back control of my life and rebuild. I'm going to rebuild this foundation after a significant loss. Somebody has had a significant loss. And it's like now I got I to gotta go. I got to go follow my dreams. There's been some sort of injustice. There has. There's been some sort of unfair treatment here. Unfair. Lack of balance and harmony. Somebody could have been holding on to a lie, okay? Something that where there was no growth, there was no passion. But the devil reversed is great because somebody's taking back control and breaking free from this lie. Because I see, I see that there's a better, there's a, there's a new arrival, there's a, there's a new opportunity. Somebody is seeing there's a new opportunity for happiness here and they're letting go. They are. They're dropping this false sense of security and accepting a new opportunity for love. Somebody has been focused on a loss for a while and now it's like I see that there's another opportunity, an exciting opportunity, and I'm probably going to take it. Yep, this is freedom. Personal freedom. This is liberation. Standing back up on your own two feet. I'm taking back control of my life. So we do have somebody here that is. They're breaking free from a situation that kept them bound and unhappy. In search for happiness. And it's like happiness is here. It's like I got this newfound happiness. I'm stepping out of my shell. I'm going to put in. You know somebody has found some strength here. Some determination to you know be happy. I got. I, I want happiness. And it looks like somebody is taking action. We do have somebody here that is taking action. It's like, I'm not going to think about that. I'm just going to do it. So we, we, somebody, is, somebody could be moving very quickly towards happiness. You know what I mean? It's just like I, I see the light. I see that there's an there's a opportunity right in front of me. And so I have to let go of this. 
loss, right? This false sense of security. Yeah, somebody is. Somebody's, somebody is removing, an obstacle is being removed. And you know what that obstacle is? It's, it's negativity. It's negative thoughts. It's fear. Somebody's cut stepping outside of their comfort zone and taking action. So I think this is going to be a very happy day. Somebody is seeing that there is an opportunity for happiness with a new potential suitor. It's exciting. This could be an invitation. Somebody could be receiving an invitation to a celebration or a party. Could make them very happy, right? We got... Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Virgo, Leo, Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Libra, Scorpio. We got everybody here because everybody's, you know, this is Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This is Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. We have everybody. Somebody has found this. It's like this newfound determination to, I got, it's time for me to be happy. I got this new potential suitor. I see that this is an opportunity for happiness and I'm going to get it. So I feel like somebody is making a move towards happiness today. Let's get a couple of these. Happy Easter. Action is being taken. It is. Somebody could be arriving. Okay. There's been a lack of wish fulfillment. Holding on to a lost oper loss. Okay, this is a loss. False sense of security. There's been no wish fulfillment there. And, and I feel like somebody's like, I'm giving up on that. I'm giving up. There's a song about that. Um, what's that song? Oh, God, what's that song? It's almost like, so I think it's like somebody to love. Giving up on loneliness. Hello, something. What the hell is that? Goodbye Loneliness. I don't even know what the name of the song is, but that's the song that I'm trying to think of. Um, I'm giving up on it. I'm giving up on it. I'm looking for happiness here. Ooh, this is what we got going on, too. Very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. I think that we do have somebody that has made a decision. I do. After being indecisive. Letting letting their own demons control their happiness. It's like no, I'm taking back control. I'm not gonna not gonna let an outside influence and fear hold me back. Getting to know each other as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Absolutely. I think we have two people here that are going to be getting to know and get know each other a little bit better. Maybe they're deciding that, you know, it's time to give the relationship a chance. I think it's a new relationship. I really do. Because this is a new suitor. So I think we have somebody here that is deciding to give a new relationship a chance after breaking free from a loss. Okay, there's been a loss here. There's been a false sense of security that somebody has held on to and somebody's deciding that it's time for me to step outside of my shell. It's time for me to be happy again. And I'm going after happiness. And they're removing that obstacle of fear. And heading in a new direction. That's what I see. I think we're going to use one of these cards today. Whew. Could be receiving an invitation or somebody could be arriving unexpectedly. Okay. You could meet somebody at a party. If, if you're going to a party. Okay. A celebration. Maybe there's a family celebration. There's, I don't know what. But this is a celebration of some sort. It's like your prayers have been heard as well with these threes. Um, inner trust. Wonderful. We've had this card before. And it's a two. It's about partnership. Twos are about partnership. Building a new foundation, like I said. Somebody is in the process of building a new foundation. Rebuilding. I think it's with a new partner. I could be wrong, though. Inner trust. Though it may be cloaked and hidden, within you lies natural magnificence. 
vibrancy, and true uniqueness. The harder this is for you to believe, the more growth this oracle is offering you now. Your opportunity for growth lies in letting go of the need to hide yourself from the world and to let go of any doubt about the wonder of what lies within you. This oracle brings you the message that it's time for you to trust yourself and let the real inner you out from behind the veil. You are being assured that you can trust your intuition and your own sense of things and move easily towards the source of that love. Be it from another person, a new path, whatever you want to pursue. Sometimes what you sense will be more challenging than this. Sometimes what you sense will be more challenging than this and will ask something different of you. Sometimes what you sense will be more challenging than this. There should be a comma right there. And will be asking something different of you. <laughs> It might be that you sense fear and sabotage lurking within someone's intentions or in the situations around you. This oracle asks you to trust yourself to find the most authentic and self-loving way to deal with that. Perhaps you have drawn this card because you are unnecessarily holding yourself back out of fear. <laughs> oh, I love it when these cards sum up what I've said. Or the lack of belief in your ability to support and care for yourself. Or in the importance of your need for self-expression in your relationships. The oracle of inner trust comes to you with this guidance. You know what you are doing. You have enough wisdom and intuition to be able to place yourself more fully in the world. To take steps to unhide yourself. Like I said, somebody's coming out of hiding. I said it right from the very beginning. And that's what we got here. That's the truth. Even if you feel you have no clue about what is happening at a broader level in your life, even if you can't quite see the whole picture of what is taking place within or around you, you still have all the wisdom and intuitive ability you need to take one step at a time and navigate your way through absolutely anything that life brings to your door. If you have been thinking of taking a leap of faith and doing things differently, whether in your personal life or whatever it is, then this oracle brings a particular message to trust your instincts and go for it. This oracle comes, as, comes at a time when the patterns of your life are shifting. You can take advantage of this shift and leap into an entirely new level of consciousness and experience. This is not a time for self-doubt or playing it small. It is a time to get in touch with your courage, boldness, and daredevil within. And to take that step into the future that is beckoning you forward. You have the wings to fly. Sometimes we don't realize it until we leap over the edge of what we have known and begin to soar into a new life. So here we have a happy new beginning. Good luck.